Hey there guys, gals, fans, and pals, your buddy John Megacycle here. Oh, another episode of... Oh yes, Captain of Industry. I was cleaning my glasses, and without my glasses I was like, am I playing Deadlock 2 again? Interesting. Anyway, back to it. Uh, we're starting to deconstruct our metallurgics. And, uh, yeah. A little weird. Feels weird. Feels really weird. Um, that goes away, and that goes away. This is slag. We're actually off on... We'll have slag removed from there. Kind of want to be careful how I do this. It doesn't have to be so surgical, but I want to be a little careful. But while that's happening, let's give just a brief recap. Last few episodes, I've been really working on clearing and pushing back this mountain, I'm kind of brute forcing my way some space. We finally got enough that I'm willing to slap down this sun gun. This is going to accommodate scrap and raw materials and lots of good stuff. So I'm really happy with that. It's gonna make our iron better. Um, I also cleared out a lot of the rain catchers here. So this is actually pulling water directly from our water bus. Uh, we added more sulfur storage because, <laughs> because, because, because. Um, that's still off. What I want to do is I wanted to deconstruct this. Okay, there's no iron left in here. Trim this out. The exhaust doesn't matter anymore. Okay. What I could do is I could put this here. That would cut down travel time because I'm eventually going to get all this moved over here. That's why I've got that process paused. Uh, how are we doing? Okay, maybe good enough at this point. What is this? Is this exhaust? I'm gonna assume it's exhaust. Okay. Now, this this thing, this thing's going to happen. And I said I wanted to give three lines of space, right? So right about there. Let's do it. That checks all the boxes. Oof, that is going to hurt a lot. What I'm going to do is I'm going to just grab this. And I'm just going to throw this somewhere else. Uh, I'm just going to throw this right there. I could utilize the blueprint book. I don't know. Part of me is like I like to just keep building this stuff over and over again. And just... It's part of a fun bit of the process. Okay, we should have plenty of workers, so that's not something I'm worried about. Let's go through this, though. Coal and limestone and scrap and slag. Off, off, off. There's no way anyone's ever going to get to you. Off, 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 on. Off, 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 off. On, on, on. Great. I think that is all correct. Truck cannot reach destination. Just give it, give it a hot second, my man. Give it a hot, hot second. Okay. So we're going to actually be redoing a lot of stuff. I'm just going to let this process a bit. 
What that'll do is that'll generate the scrap. The scrap we could probably belt. And just bring it all the way up here. But that'll be handled by this very neatly. Now what I'm hoping we have is enough construction materials to, fi to finish at least one of these. And it looks like we did. Right here. Perfect. 4.3... Well, this doesn't require any maintenance. Oh, man. I didn't realize how much more maintenance all this was going to cost. We might have to be a little on the careful side with how many of these we just slapped down. But I'm hoping to slap one more down for copper, and we're going to be pretty good. Um, that is going to be a massive jolt to our copper. Copper's going to be a little longer. It's going to be a little bit of a thicker system because of the electrolysis, which I still haven't gotten figured out yet. I mean, it's literally water and sulfur. It's not super difficult or complex. Uh, this is going to make 14.6 eggs. Uh, and I need 8? That's awesome. Okay, good surplus, good unity. What else can I spend unity on? I'm so desperate. I want to spend it on anything I can. Uh, I don't need water saver. I don't need a farming boost. Ship fuel saver? Sure. We already have a health boost. We don't need a growth boost. We don't need a growth pause. Quarantine is fine. Plenty of food. We're doing Cracker Jack. We're doing very, very well this playthrough. 100%. We have stupid amounts of extra food. 12.2 vegetables. Actually, hang on. How much potato? Four? Four and twelve. Let's make sure we're making 12 veg. 3, uh, 7.8, 11, 12, point three? I lost count. Crap. Hey, remember when I said I was really tired? Guess what? Still a thing. 9, that's 12.3. Oh, holy crap. 20? Oh, we're making so much vegetable. It's embarrassing. Well, it's not... I don't know how overproduction can be embarrassing, but it's... We're in the good. We're in the very, very good. And we got eggs, and everything's just so good. Now, there's two things that I think I've made points of earlier, but I do want to make them still points of them now. Uh, one of the things is... I've learned a lot about the game. So there's been some very significant improvements from my end... Wholesale. Just wholesale. Easy stuff. The second thing that I want to make clear is there have been a lot of balancing changes and a lot of balancing improvements on how the game is structured and how it operates. Um, I think after, like a month after my last episode, there was a lot of rebalancing to health. And then I think three or four months later after that or something, there was the rework. Um, I want that prioritized. Um, there was the big rework that was like, we rebalanced everything. And it just, it was incredible. And it, at that moment is when I really wanted to do a restart. And I was like, you know what? I really want to start over. But I let it sit, right? Just let it marry for a bit. Just let it let it simmer in its own sauces for a while. And I did. And I'm glad I did. Because there's been even more improvements. And even more FPS updates. And even more all these really cool things. Yep, I forgot to do this. Oh, funny story. Uh, it's not built yet. That's going to take a while. Once we do all this metallurgic reshuffling, what I'd very much also like to do is I'd like to very much revamp how we handle assembly. Most of these are assembly level ones. I don't think there are any uh, assembly manual, assembly manual. This is the only assembly electric. Um, all these other ones are just manual. And what I wanted to do is I wanted to make sure we kept tabs on how much power we were consuming. And I thought electrifying everything was going to be a really bad example of putting any of that into practice. Yep, just shut off 
power we're not spending. That was what, 12, 13 workers I'm not wasting? Yeah, perfect. Now see, what I would love with a circuit network, right now, with a circuit network, what I'd like is, we're full on diesel. Because we're full on diesel, we're not making any more light oil. Because we're not making any more light oil, we're not distilling it at stage three. So what I'd love to say is, hey, if this thing's over 80%, just mute three of these. Not mute. Pause. Man. Uh, language is tough, man. I just can't even sometimes. That's okay. I don't have to even all the time. Now that we're this far, I really don't need all this extra storage, but that did help us through some tight some tight situations. Okay, how much more do we need? Oh, we're so close. I'm just going to sit here, sip some water, and watch some stuff happen. Don't forget, get up, stretch often. Drink water often. Can't stress that enough. Water does a body good. I was like, do I need one more part? I need five more. Ah, uh, now I need one more. Ah, uh, cheap. Cheap, cheap. This is going to be so awesome the very second this is ready. And there it is. Okay. Uh, raw iron ore goes in. Crushed iron ore comes out of the crushers. Iron ore crushed is then pushed into two blast furnaces. The piping hot molten iron is then forced into some metal casters. Metal casters, then. Iron plates. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I like it. It's quite compact. It's lean. Yeah, I'm digging it. I'm digging it real hard. So now, what I'm hoping to see is scrap iron. We want to emphasize scrap iron as often as possible, above all else. Because it doesn't produce slag, it produces less to, less exhaust, and it's one less thing we have to mine out of the ground. Everything we have to mine out of the ground requires fuel. Uh, in some in some fashion, in some form. Diesel, we've been pretty good. We got our petrochem really set up nice. But that's also not an infinite thing. Yeah, we've got a lot of iron ore store here. I like this. This is really beautiful. A little a little mishmashy here, but I kind of like that I don't need a separate system. I don't know food. Uh-oh. Okay, hold on. We were sitting on a lot of excess. What happened? Uh, vegetables can't be turned into that. So this is kind of exactly what I was afraid of. I didn't add a lot more people. I don't see anything getting... Okay, why? Uh, I guess 54 is fine. Um, did we hit a huge food boom? Corn is full, potatoes are full, vegetables are full. What I would expect to have seen... How much feed are you using? So I need 30 feed every 60. That shouldn't be that big of a problem, but it seems like that's a really big problem. I said force empty. Uh, 
Uh, do I have animal feed on any other power plant? Nope. Okay. Uh, I wish I knew what you just did. Oh, vegetables wouldn't help anyway. Vegetables aren't even a recipe thing here. Do I have one that's just corn? I think I do. Yeah, but I'd have to pipe the fertilizer all the way up here, which I'm not really feeling. Um, guess what? You're gonna turn into corn. Bibbity bobbity corn. You can do it. Come on. Come on. Okay, fine. Whatever, I can take a hint. It's a conveyor that's U-shaped. Uh... That looks like corn to me. Okay, that'll offset our disgusting vegetable surplus. <laughs> How uncouth. And uh, hopefully take care of a little bit more... Okay, we're gonna pause growth. So if we continuously lose chickens, that should hopefully normalize a little bit better. Yeah, okay. And because I removed out some veg, there we go, turn that up a bit. Okay, a little bit of a delay here, but we should be able to get back to some decent numbers with chicken feed. Uh, actually, this number I like a little bit better. 800, about, instead of 1,000. There, that should take care of that real nicely. Okay. We're seven away, we can start dealing with iron scrap. It's gonna be glorious. In the words of Arvatos Vex, glorious. I can't get my voice gravelly like that anymore. <clears> there <throat> was a good while I sounded like Tom Waits. Which I thought was really cool, but my esophagus didn't appreciate it. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? Okay, so now. Nope. Now? No. I'm going to see some iron scrap up in this business. There we go. So now what I'm hoping to see is it'll load. It'll take priority. Yep, there we go. Beautiful. And that produces... Yeah, same stuff. That'll let our iron ore catch up a bit. Oh, yeah, you know what we'll do? Yes! <laughs> eh, why? Why is this okay? This shouldn't be okay. <laughs> uh, I feel so bad for this game sometimes that it has to do all the passing for me. Uh, okay. Yep, so we're working through all the iron scrap first. That's letting this stack up, yep. We have a very large repository here, and this is loose storage level 3. We will be able to eventually upgrade to loose storage level 4. But that, yeah, that's, that's grand right there. Perfect.
Okay, are we getting through more of our recycling? What I'm actually going to do is I'm going to pause that guy like we have been doing. I might just take this blue storage and move the recycling right over here. That might be the ultimate gimmick. So we have the raw storage. We have the take uh, that's holding it here uh, with a compactor. We then have all that feeding to the recycling. The recycling then splitting out and then being prioritized furthermore, heretofore, blah, blah, blah. So that's ultimately our plan. I don't have nearly enough construction parts to do that again. So we're going to have to be a little patient. Uh... Do we have level two? We don't have level two parts. Ah, uh, that's always the problem with this system. Uh, the problem always is because things feed into each other, it'll always prioritize the highest level. So we have up to level three. It'll prioritize level three. It does that by taking all the level two and turning it into level three, which it sounds fine on paper. But the bigger issue is if I need level two or even level one, not producing enough, that's that's big, big problem. I have so much unity, just have at. Just have at. What's your problem, my dude? How in the world did you get mech parts? There are no designations. Did you really do it? By Jove, you did it. By Jove, you did it. Okay, so that... This looks like this. I don't actually need that far. I need... Oh, I need actually... I'm more interested in this. That's going to be a little more important. So it's not, not going to take us super long, but like the next step is copper. Copper and recycling would be really cool. Uh, yep, we're now getting some Tech 2 product. Okay, this is a little more better. More better? Uh, not really, because I'm now not making enough eggs. Um, what I would like to know is if this is... Come on, man. Uh, if it's ever empty, let me know. Are we full up on eggs, though? No, kind of. We have enough for 10 months? Holy crap, awesome. That's a lot of eggs. Considering how much our people are fiending, absolutely fiending for protein, yeah, it makes a lot of sense. I'm going to ignore this for a while. Actually, I'm just going to close it for now. Uh, I'm sure it'll pop back up eventually and or later, and then we'll just deal with it then. Man, it did not take us long to catch up on all our iron, did it? I didn't put enough space in there. Let me try that again. Man, comma. It didn't take a lot of time for us to fill up our iron, comma, did it? Too many commas now. Now I hate it. I've reached that point in my life where I don't know anymore how often commas ought to be used. And I just use them whenever the hell I want. Which is freaking unfortunate for everyone involved. Uh, yep. For everyone involved. I don't need this nearly as full. I don't need this nearly as full. That can still get evacuated as quickly as possible. Okay, where did I leave my blueprint? So we have the casting. So I'm going to make another copy of this. Actually, can I... How, does, how do blueprints work? I keep forgetting. Uh, new blueprint. 
This is Iron Iron. I'm gonna call it Tech 2 instead of Mark 2. Let's call it T2. Um, Mark MK is a uh, revision. T as in a tech is like a tech level, not necessarily a revision. If it was tech one, second revision, it'd be T1 M MK2. First tech level, second revision. This is the second tech, first revision. So it'd be tech two, MK1. Um, but I don't usually go through revisions in this example, so it's not really that big of a deal uh, for me to muck with stuff. Okay. Let's put you there. So this is... Oh. Uh, I should have put that on the other side, because I plan on putting copper here. It's okay. It can have its own slag bucket. It's fine. Um, this will look like this. The only real difference for this is going to be... Let's just walk through the whole process, right? Copper ore. And then this is going to be copper ore crushed. These recipes are going to change. I'll just do it manually. It's fine. Copper ore, copper ore crushed. This isn't going to be iron scrap. This is going to be copper scrap. Limestone, coal, and slag are all going to be the same. Instead of this doing anything with iron, it's going to be copper scrap, copper ore crushed. Uh, we want scrap on top, which we have. Okay. Now, this is actually going to get this into an impure copper. So the impure copper is going to be stored here. Impure copper. Uh, don't take the impure copper. And actually, you know what? You can bring me impure copper. But don't peddle it anywhere else. Okay, impure copper needs further more work. I need a water electrolyzer. I keep forgetting what the name of it is. Copper electrolysis, not electrolyzer. Uh, this can take 16 every 40. This produces 8 every 20. 8 every 20 times 2 is 16 to 40. Simple math right there. If I ever do say so myself. Okay, so how do we make this look good and use space properly? I kind of want the output to be here. So we have like an avenue for trucks to just grab and go and they don't have to feed into stuff. Because that seems a little annoying. Um... Hold on. Eight eight forty sixteen four. Am I daft? That would be sixteen forty. What do the old metal casters do? Eight forty. Oh, okay. It's twice as fast. Uh, I am tired. That's... Yeah, so... <laughs> I think I need two of these. Holy crap. Hold on. Eight every 20. Yes, I need two of these. Okay. I am not losing my mind. Okay. Ooh, okay. I do need two of these things. So... This is going to be a fat kid. Uh, to really maximize space, I might have to do something like this. 
but I don't want trucks coming up the side for stuff. I, I literally really want it like this, but that also seems dumb. Okay. Let's take this. No, I want both of them. There. Oh, no, no, don't build it. Oh, my God. <laughs> I wasn't ready. I thought I had the planner still on. Oh, sorry, Fat Beats. You gotta take that somewhere else. <laughs> Crap. Oh, I get two. I get two in the moment. That's what I'm gonna blame it on. My ambition. That's what I'll blame it on. Uh, I'm sure normal folk would call me a dumbass. I call me overly ambitious. Yes, that sounds right. Okay. Um, just dump it somewhere and vacate the base. Thanks. Okay, cool. There's that. How's our chicken feed now? Uh, we're out of it. But they're getting some, so that's fine. Okay. Uh, copper electrolysis. Let's try this again. I could just feed them directly in to this. But I want to have a place because aren't there other ways I can make impure copper or I can buy impure copper? For some odd reason, I thought I needed an impure copper. Impure copper. How do I make that? No, this is the only way to make it. Maybe I'm thinking of the recycling setup that we might have had in the last season. I cannot trade for impure copper. It's either copper ore or <laughs> it's uh, ready to go copper. Um, okay. We still have a little bit of time before I need to be pressing this into service. Trim, trim. Trim, trim. Thank you. Okay. Um, I already have this as a blueprint. So, guess what? Boop. Bibbidi boop. Oodle you. Um, let's go ahead and start extrapolating one side of this, and then we'll go from there. So, nuke, nuke. Okay. Nope. Oh, I wish Control Z was a thing. Um, okay, I screwed up. I went a little too fast. Can we do this? Nope. Yep. Okay, that's back to where we were. This is going to make our impure copper. So the only other real option I could... I really don't want to make this any wider. Um, really don't want to make this any wider, but if I had to, could I? I could. Without a lot of crying or gnashing of teeth, but... Oh, I was hoping not to. Okay, so how would this look? We build an electrolysis system. I need eight. I need 16 every 40. Even a level one belt would be more than enough. Realistically, if this stuff is going to kick out this side, I might as well just reverse this whole damn thing. So, nuke, nuke, nuke. <laughs> Say it with me now. Damn. Okay. Uh, it's blocked because of slag. Man, 
Man, this feels like this weighs so much space. Um... Transport to selected position was not found. Are you sure? And now keep going? Yeah, there you go. Look at you, son. I knew you could do it. <laughs> Why was that confusing? Um, okay, let's get rid of this. I genuinely don't have a plan for 95% of what I do. I'm just having a good time about it. That makes that so stupidly wide, and I'd have to do the same thing on the other side. Um, can we do, what if we back it up like this, like a bunch, and then, then, uh, I'm going to be honest with myself, this looks terrifically uninspired. The good thing is I'm aiming for compactness, not trying to be inspired, so nuts to that. Nope. What the hell? <laughs> Dude, what happened here? Just, just cancel the whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't want... I don't know what you were trying to do there, but no, I don't want a magazine subscription or whatever the crap was happening. Okay, so this is going to be doing a little bit of extra footwork. This curves back like a snake. And then we pipe in the acid to properly wash the system. So for storage, we're going to do fluid storage level 2. Now, this kind of goes against my rule of I don't want a bunch of trucks flip-flopping about. But if we keep this back end open, they need to come back here anyway. So that doesn't seem like a big issue to me. This acid wash is going to be amazing because it doesn't just yield the 13 plates we were doing before with water. This will yield an additional 3 plates for every single transaction. It's going to be dope. Might not sound like a lot, but it's it's really cool. Uh, let's do 108. Fine. Acid. Acid. Off. Off. Everything off. You can pull... Oh, no. No, this is supposed to be regular-ass copper. There you go. Uh, yep, that's fine. Okay, so we're going to try something here. I'm going to nuke that and that. Let's see how much of this I can copy so I don't have to do this again. If I have to do it again, it's also not the end of the world. But it's a game about automation, damn it. Should be automating. Okay, how does this fly? Uh oh. No, wait. Nope. <laughs> Damn it, that, none of those things are what I wanted to have happen. Okay, I need this. I need it. There, perfect. Damn, why was that hard? Okay, I need this to go... Here. But I cannot because... The smokestack is in the way. So if we drop it down one square, what does that look like? Oh! I kind of wish there was like an x-ray vision mode. Okay, there's that. Does everything else still remain connected? This is really hard to do with so many shades of gray. I, I 
I'm genuinely starting to lose a little bit of context here, but that's okay. That goes there. That goes there. That needs a tank. It collides, which is fun fortunate. New supply of coal, really? Are we not getting any more of the good stuff? We should be. Okay, work on that. Um, okay, what was I doing? So this is unfortunately going to be not nearly as symmetrical as I hoped. Symmetry is not... It's not the best and it's not the worst. It's not something that we're going to cry if we don't have. I just... If I can manage, I'd like to manage. Um... I... I could do this if I took this and I cut it. I don't think that saved me anything other than that, which is what I wanted. Um, okay. I would like to make this symmetrical if I can. So let's just spend another minute or two. The game is still playing. Like, we're not missing anything here. How does that fly? Uh, what's ironic is I can't move this... Oh, can I move it left one now? No. No. at the correct spot. That's the spot. Ooh, dang. Okay, I'm almost done specking out the copper scrap, copper scrap. Okay. Yep, I'm almost done specking this out. The engineers are going to be mad. They're going to get my document of specifications. They'll be like, blee blah blue blah blee blah blee. They'll be like, all right, fine. It'll be 300 tier 3 construction materials. And I'll be like, fine. Do it. And I'll change my mind. Like, I'll have a coffee and I'll change my mind? <laughs> no, 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 no. The pinwheels go on top. <laughs> or just something. Just some, some errant dumb crap complaint. Because... Yep. I don't know why, but that's all I can think of right now. Um, so there's that. Coal is restoring. How are the chickens? Uh, we still don't have any excess feed. So this is what I wanted to kind of try to avoid. Now, did we get a bunch of carcasses? No. Uh, chicken starving to death does not mean good, good meat, so that's good to know. That is still very full. This is still very full. Yep, serves are great. How are the saplings? We're kind of low on saplings. Did I stop sapling production entirely? I did. Mon dieu. My French is bad. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying to pick up new languages and stuff, and you can tell when it works, you can tell when it doesn't. Uh, that please. How am I using ethanol? Did I set this to using ethanol? I did. Okay. Cool. Uh, I don't remember doing that, but that's okay. I did that. I'm going to own up. I did that. That shuts off. Uh, I think we're ready. Let's take one more gander. I need double the T2. Or the T3 supplies. Here's what we're actually going to do. Uh, let's do this. Is 
That's not going to give us a ton of excess, but it's going to give us a bit. Um, shut off ship fuel saver. Boost me up a little extra unity. Um, so off. I don't want any more deliveries. Very soon we're going to shift over and do copper. We're out of scrap. Man. So anytime we buy scrap, which we can do very easily now, it'll just get instantly incorporated into the system. We don't have to worry about anything. Uh, we're going to leave that be. Because I'm not ready to move recycling yet. I should have just left it be for a while longer. So copper goes here. Recycling is going to go somewhere in here, which is going to be awesome. And then it'll just feed all the way in. Now I knew that last season, or I, I guess I know now, hindsight being 2020, is a lot of my layouts were inefficient because I didn't know the big picture. I didn't know how all these systems talked to each other. Now that we've gotten a run in, I understand a lot better now. So putting recycling right next to the metallurgy is very important. The less trucks we need doing stuff, the better. So once this gets clobbered and re-added and recycling comes over here, uh, it's going to be great. There's going to be a lot less of this bebopping around, at least from recycling's perspective. So we'll get there. We'll get there. It'll take some time. But we'll get there. Let me guess. You can't make it to an excavator? Yeah, because these excavators are freaking daredevils, my dude. Look at them. You see that? They're freaking snowboarding champions or whatever. What are you doing? Did I tell you to do that? Interesting. Um. All right. I don't have words, I don't think. Uh, okay, <laughs> anyway. Um, let's walk through this one more time. Copper ore drops off. Copper ore gets crushed. Copper ore crushed. I have this on off, don't I? Over here? I do. Okay, let's let's maintain the rule. Off, off. You're going to remove slag. You're going to bring me copper scrap. You're going to bring me limestone. You're going to bring me coal. We then smelt this down into impure molten copper. Oh, you need sand. You don't need limestone. Ooh, I'm glad I looked. Uh, I'm very glad I looked. Okay, sand. Uh, I'm not harvesting sand. How do I make sand? That's... Okay, good. Good thing we asked and talked about things. Sand, sand. Okay. We can crush quartz into sand. Uh, I'm crushing something to make sand, aren't I? Oh no, I'm using the other recipe. I'm using manufactured sand, which is crushed slag. Nope. Crushed rock. I really thought there was a way you could take rock, crush it to gravel, take gravel, crush it into sand. I must have hallucinated that. But that's what the manufactured sand is now. Uh, we can crush quartz into sand, which seems really dumb. And I still don't know what quartz is used for. I still... I still don't know. Uh... Q-U-A-R-T-Z? Concrete production. Quartz into quartz crushed. Good. I'm glad we figured that out. Man, I must be really daft, because I cannot figure out what this is used for. I thought it was used for silicon poly or something. Molten silicon? Nope. <laughs> I... I don't have the slightest. Okay. Um...
Uh, quartz. Quartz crushed. Quartz crushed. Into sand. It literally the only purpose of quartz is to make sand. Uh, okay. I'm not gonna cry about it, but I, I man, old old man John can't remember stuff. I was like, I swear, there's something about this that I should be using instead of digging up sand. But uh, yeah, all right, here we are. Um, let's monitor this. Maybe I can steal the level one excavator out of. I definitely can. Okay, and where's the mining thing for this guy? Oh, you have a big one? Wait. Whoops. Oh, I wanted the small excavator. My bad. My bad. My bad. There we go. The small excavator looks larger than the big excavator because the thumbnail's weird. It should just have a really big letter S on it or something for small? Whatever, doesn't matter. Um, I'm going down to height, what, two? Oh, height one, okay. Uh, let's go ahead and do this. That seems a little erratic. What's this height, two? Um, is this the only path you guys have been able to use to get up and down? No, there's a few. Okay, thank goodness. That was gonna be really pedantic if I just cut this whole thing. And it's like, guess what, idiot? <laughs> now you ain't got no room. Oh, man. That make me sad, sad, sad. Um, we can go around and up if we need more. Limestone. Severe flu. Low animal feed. Okay, but we're caught up mostly, so that's good. Uh, hopefully that severe flu won't last super long. We do have the extra health buffer. So that's good. We don't have a hospital. Yet. I was hoping to get all our metal working done first, but it looks like we're about ready to slap this sucker down. So I'm actually going to go ahead and pause, and we're going to do that next episode. So we're just going to leave a little bit of a gap here. Something like that, maybe? Or Oh, let's, let's have another ghost thumbnail. Why not? There you go. Okay. Uh, yeah, super good stuff. Moving up the, well, not really the tech ladder, but we're getting things a lot more modernized and sophisticated, so I call that a win. Thank you all for joining me. My name is John Megacycle, and another episode of Captain of Industries in the Books, and I hope to catch you next time. Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and Game With My Crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.